If you've been out to the lakefront lately or, or even just driven on the causeway, you might have noticed a bright green hue to the water. Yeah, blooms of potentially dangerous algae are present across Lake Pontchartrain. Paul Murphy reports the algae has already caused some isolated fish kills in the lake. Lake Pontchartrain now resembles the Chicago River on St. Patrick's Day. It's not green dye in the water, it's algae and it's blooming across the lake. Recreational fisherman Michael Ward says he's never seen it this bad. We were out here yesterday to check it out and we found a lot of floating green algae in the water. And I was concerned, so I, I called up the Department of Wildlife and Fisheries and the DEQ for Louisiana. So far, neither department has issued a health warning because of the algae. But Brady Skaggs from the Pontchartrain Conservancy says the blooms are potentially dangerous depending on the variety of microorganism. If it is a cyanobacterial population, then it can produce several different types of compounds that are toxic. Dave Hansen spent his lunch hour swimming and relaxing in the lake. The water is like about 85, so it's really, it's really warm. It's like a bath. It's so warm. And the algae doesn't bother you? No, not at all. The last time algae blooms were this substantial in Lake Pontchartrain was in 2019. That's when the Bonnie Carey Spillway was open a record 123 days. That sent nutrient-rich water from the Mississippi River into the lake. Scientists say this year, warm temperatures and heavy rains are to blame for the blooms. Certainly, we've had record amounts of rainfall already exceeding our annual rainfall in the month of, of August. So there is a tremendous amount of, of storm water. Uh, that storm water stands to, to rush other forms of pollution into the lake. When the algae die off and settle to the bottom of the lake, it can deplete the oxygen in the water, causing fish kills. About two weeks ago, there was a bad algae bloom right out near the end of the runway, and we saw three or four floating dead drum about two feet long. It's unclear how long the blooms will be present in the lake. In the past, when temperatures cool off, algae growth slows down. Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. Well, scientists say you shouldn't swim where you see algae. Well, certain types of blue-green algae can cause rashes and stomach cramps and other health problems.